Here comes the actually really pretty main menu music. Fuck. Oh, God. <clears throat> Why are we playing this game? <laughs> oh, no, not Disney. Squeenix is on thin ice, but Disney... Uh... <laughs> Disney is on no ice. <laughs> Disney owns Disney, the ice, Disney okay? Sank. We're skating Disney, on their ice. <laughs> Disney owns the ice, and somehow they still don't know what they're doing. Oh, Lord. Oh, Listen well, to that, that's shit. why there's no ice in Smash. I'm waiting oh, for... Uh, Squeenix to come out and say, oh, by the way, uh, in Kingdom, uh, we're releasing NFTs, and yes, they will be lore relevant to Kingdom Hearts 4. Oh my god. Every NFT <laughs> is canon. <laughs> uh, people were freaking out because of a thing that Nomura said, where apparently, uh, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's not the case, because it was vague, but he was considering when it came to Smash, that there was a problem with putting Sora in because he wanted to know what it meant for the lore. <laughs> <laughs> and that makes me angry. <laughs> no more. Yeah, that's and it may be. Like that's like the opposite of uh, why um, Kiryu from Yakuza isn't in Smash. Like there's like super lame reasons. Like you know, oh, but what about our lore? And then you got stuff like Kiryu where he's like, he doesn't hit women. And I'm like, yo, that's that's based. Oh, that that that's based. <laughs> that's extreme. That, <laughs> that 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 I that, that man guzzles his respect women juice, and that's just that's. Spaced, man. You, you could just make it to where anytime he attempts to attack a woman, he just dies instantaneously. So he could still at least be in the game. Also, this is way too pretty for fucking 2001. This game was released in the same year that America got Sonic Adventure fucking 2. Sonic no, I Adventure 2. It, was bro, it hasn't even been four minutes. Hold on, hold on. I need to check because now I'm angry. It hasn't even been four minutes, guys, and we already brought up Sonic. Shut Let's go. the fuck up, soon. <laughs> yeah, the same. We're, we're, eventually, we're just gonna we're just gonna introduce like you know you know what is it? Whenever we start something like uh like you know Devil May Cry, and we're like this came what? out the same year yeah, as Sonic like... Generations. <laughs> Welcome Sonic to DMC Five. So anyway, Sonic the Hedgehog. Listen, I think Dante is the Sonic of action heroes. But Sonic's oh, the, not, the Sonic I'm of Action play, Heroes. I'm gonna play Armored Core 3 and yell about no, okay. how the controls suck. Okay, anyways, I fucking... Let's talk about Sonic. <laughs> I fucking lied to you, I'm sorry. It came out in March of 2002. But yeah, that's, that's still that's just a, a little bit... That's a, not very long after Sonic Adventure 2. Yeah, there's, like, and, there are some really great games that look like garbage that came out in, uh, in 2002. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah, okay, this is okay. pre-rendered but, still, but... Uh, I even mean, the pre-render stuff is amazing for this era. Yeah, like, no, this still looks like really good. Like, well, okay, you know, this, we're, is, we're, this is like this is the argument of like arts of like having an actual art style over just being like we need all the graphics. Yeah, <laughs> I, I really like. It took a minute for Kingdom Hearts three to grow on me in terms of like its graphics because at first I thought it looked really bad, but then I realized everything looked like it was made of Play-Doh. Uh, it, it, it's not as bad as 2.8. 2.8 looks ridiculous to me. Uh, uh, why is there two Soras? No, nah, so this music Dude, also there's slaps. Only two. Wait, there that's was only two spoiler. Soras? <laughs> that's not a spoiler. God damn it, that's spoiler. not what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'll get into that shit eventually. There's going to be some right, fucking right, stupid right, ass lore. All right, before we get into it, everybody's knowledge on Kingdom Hearts 2 and how many games they've played. Uh, I've played. Uh, I played through all of Kingdom Hearts One, and I played through Kingdom Hearts Two, um, up until uh, you had to. Until like shortly after you go from playing as Roxas to going back to Sora, um, because Who I. The fuck uh, is Roxas? Really, what it was? It was. I was just like, oh, you know, I'll, I'll, be back, I'll get back to this later, and then later never happened because I was lazy and non-committal. That uh, happens, which is why man. I'm single. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yes. and I, but what I joke about is that, oh, it's because, you know, I, I just, it's, it's, it's because, oh, I don't want Disney's bullshit and I relate to Roxas too much. <laughs> dude, I, I, dude, Roxas Relatable. makes my heart hurt. Roxas is just like, Tommy. Oh, I can't uh, hang out today, um, guys. We're broke. I've, it's like, <laughs> me too. I played uh, about like 15 minutes of 358 over two days, and I watched the intro wow. video for him in Smash. So I'm basically ah, a goddamn damn. expert. Damn! Well, I thought I was probably... gonna be the one with the least experience. I played <laughs> part, I played parts of one, parts of two. Played an entirety of Rechain of Memories on the Game Boy Advance, and uh, that's about it. Oh man! I, I'll, I'll, like all I know is just the the lore is a mess, uh, but there's a lot of cool stuff, so it's okay. 
It's a, it's it's that classic Square Enix uh, flair on top of classic Disney. That's all I know. Uh, also, Xehanort. There's a lot. <laughs> there's a lot of Xehanorts, yes. So I usually go for uh, magic. This is this is this is a thing that's in the beginning of every game where it's like, oh, you get three different paths, and it's not just your stats that change; it's actually the things that you get throughout the game. It's kind of cool. Uh, uh, Donald's so, magic, dude. Uh, I usually go for magic because I like a lot of magic, but I think I'm gonna go for this because I get uh... ah shit. So, so wait, which of the seven dwarfs is this one? Uh, uh shitty, my favorite. Ah. <laughs> I've played through every single Kingdom Hearts game, except for the one that sucks, which uh, is. Uh, I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm gonna let the comments decide which one that is. No, I think the only one that I haven't played through all the way is uh, Recoded. Uh, by the way, I just gave up the the shield, which is the speed run route. You're supposed to choose shield and nothing else, but I'm an asshole, so I didn't. The hell fucking face was that? <laughs> sort of in the Boy, first two games. He, he, he's like doing his best DK impression. <laughs> DK. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> nah, so, so back in 2020, I was like, hey, I know that Kingdom Hearts thing exists. It's like in my periphery all the time. So then I went through and played every game in order of, of story. And I just binged it for like a really long time. You know, nice. I think Kingdom Hearts is the one game where you don't get the argument of what order you should play it in because it's a mess either way. It, it is a mess, yes. I, I had to actually get a time because uh, I already knew the, ahead of time. The, the, that the best order is release order, but in reverse. So you play the newest one first and then you go backwards. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the games no, get better if you do it. No, that no way. you play them in reverse quality <laughs> order, and then you give up after two games, and then you can be like, "I have an educated opinion on why this series sucks." You <laughs> played all the bad ones, so it sucks. Because <laughs> uh, I heard Barry from Game Grumps fame uh, and his opinions. That was a good video. I did like that video. It the, was a uh, good video. Which video? Uh, Barry. Uh, what's his last name? Kramer. Uh, Kramer. Barry Kramer's. Uh, Barry Kramer. uh, 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 Kingdom Hearts in a nutshell, like series where he v like, oh, goes to the oh yeah 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 where he where it's like all he's got all the little doodles and shit and he talks yeah, yeah, about yeah. that was nice yeah I've, I've I watched that one I think four times it's a very it's a it's a very fun video Xehanort yeah. turns into a boat so you know it's serious <laughs> <laughs> okay no I watched I watched that I watched that video with my roommates in the background so hello roommate get ready to be on YouTube um, got him for all of like four subscribers. Nah, nah. Fuck. Well, viewers. Ah. Um, hey, <laughs> there hey, we, we have, have, we have a total of. Hold on. <laughs> yes, to think about it. <laughs> we have a total of at least one. Mm -hmm. At least ten. It's a <laughs> fucking door, dog. We have forty-eight subscribers. Okay. Oh, don't Hell get yeah. it right. <laughs> get the okay, fifteen. You, you, you know what? I'll, I'll be honest. Uh, I'll, it. I'll, it. I'll, just, I'll just admit now, I'm not subscribed to us because I've been never, never been able to find our channel. <laughs> yeah. You found it? No, no, you found it once. I saw your comment, you little shit. <laughs> I have a comment somewhere. Let me see if I can find that. Uh, so it's because it, it's it's because in order to actually find us, you have to put in best dudes, not the best dudes. Oh yeah, we're best dudes, not the best dudes. Even the, though it, the best dudes was taken. Yeah, the best dudes was taken. Uh, anyway, we opened the door, almost. Uh, I got a barrel. So what were we talking about, Donkey Kong? Uh, yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Kong. the damn thing disappeared. Okay. So Donkey Kong. My deal with Kingdom K H. Kingdom Hearts is terrible. Not enough syllables, but too many syllables. He I mean, Kingdom Hearts fuck. is ridiculous, but I, I still enjoyed. It. I still enjoyed playing Kingdom Hearts one and two. I'm not gonna say like, oh, you know, I. I'm not gonna say I dislike Kingdom Hearts. I am gonna say I hate Disney, and you know, if Kingdom Hearts <laughs> didn't, I think the best parts of Kingdom Hearts are the parts where you're not running around Disney worlds. Except Tron because Tron is great and Disney will never do anything with Tron again and I will suffer for the rest of my existence. 
Uh, I think right? these games are great for its target audience. Final Fantasy fans? No. <laughs> we have boost. Yeah. I, I mean, same thing, but. Yeah, we fans. No. Yeah, yeah, yes, yes. 13 year old edge boys and edge girls. Oh, wait, I chose the. No, I chose the wrong. I was supposed to choose the top. Wait, 13 year old I, I edge boys and what? Edge girls. Edge girls, ooh. Yeah. Uh, that sounds dirty. I don't like it. <laughs> also, Seuss, you get you gotta Seuss, I love you, but you gotta turn your mic up or get a little closer to it. I can't hear you and it makes me sad. I can't hear Is you. Is this anymore. good? Oh wow. fuck, you're so <laughs> that's so loud. Well, hey, now at least I can hear his beautiful voice. This is my true. Beautiful, sultry voice. Oh yeah. My, my beautiful <clears throat> sultry anus. Oh boys. Oh, okay, yeah. so this game this game has a pr really cool progression system. All right, uh, I just made a bunch of different choices, and what those things do is it actually changes how the game's progression works. The first choice that I that I made was the choosing what weapon I I wield. That actually chooses what like skills and and like progression tree I I get at the beginning, like a different class essentially. So mm -hmm. I'm gonna get a lot more like uh, uh, attack skills and shit like that. Uh, earlier on, and the three so questions. So you're telling me I this just, game copied Kotor? Uh, don't fucking sass me, Seuss. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the other thing that the, that the game did I'm was not the, hearing a no. Uh, I mean, well, here's here's the thing. Star Wars is owned by Disney. Checkmate. <laughs> oh in, shit! Kotor still isn't canon. Oh. That makes me very sad. Oh, it's gonna be. Oh, think yeah. about it. They're they're, they're, they're doing. Well, they're doing the the remaster of it, so. Oh yeah, I forgot they were making a remake. Yep. Hi, so, Anthony, do tell what are these creatures you're just decimating? Those things are called shadows, and they're pieces of shit. Uh, you'll learn to hate them. Pieces. Uh, I, you, you know what? Uh, uh, we we got to give Anthony credit. We can tell he's on his path to recovery because he just said the word shadow and did not instantly bring up Sonic. So <laughs> I thought about it, but I you bring it, it. Hey, but hey, you bring them right the back in until they start pulling until they start pulling out 1911s. In which case, now I've just <laughs> now unfortunately I've probably just started a butterfly effect of giving Tetsuya Nomura an idea. I just want to bring you know, up that this he's gonna is really see this pretty YouTube for video. A PS2 he's gonna game. hear this clip. He's gonna be like, I got it. Guns no, no, no! It's gonna be, it's gonna be until... a six degrees of separation scenario. Oh, yeah. No, one of us knows a guy who knows a guy who knows a guy who knows <laughs> Tetsuya Nomura. Uh, I know a guy who might know Tetsuya Nomura. Oh. Oh. oh no! <laughs> Two degrees of separation. Three, three, three. Fuck. Damn. <laughs> shit. Because yeah, I was thinking about it, it's like, oh shit. I do work with somebody like that. <laughs> oh fuck! Look at that. Fuck. We can influence the development of Kingdom it's Hearts Nephilus. 4. <laughs> Poor Bell. Oh man, this guy's an asshole. Looks like an asshole. Okay, yeah. when I did this bit, I, everything I was just like, okay, just just wail on him a bit until he stops moving. Got it. Uh, you you actually are supposed to hit him in the face. So this game has a, a very interesting mechanic that they fucking remove in every subsequent game. There's a thing called tech points. If you do specific actions while fighting an enemy, you will actually gain experience just, you know, in general. So I'm going to run up his hand. It's kind of difficult, but I just gained two XP. So, so you're supposed like, to be hitting his hand, but like since you did the cool sicko mode thing, then you got yeah, the you, got, you get some extra shit for it. And it's like, they never bring that concept back and it makes me upset. Because it's so interesting. Uh, it makes a lot a lot of fights uh, less uh, button mashy because most of the time your tech points are going to be parries. So like, that. Uh, where, whoa. Where you hit, where you hit like a projectile or something and ow, ow. I, mean, I feel like it's a good way of encouraging experimentation without like yeah. forcing experimentation where you know exactly. it's like if you don't do anything interesting you can still win or you can like yeah. see obscure obscure little weaknesses and get a bunch of extra p pity points it, it also uh, gives experienced players a way to level up quicker and get to the fun part because 
one thing that every single kingdom no, no matter how good the game is or which game it is every fucking single cage game sucks until like three hours in because it takes so long to get to the fun part of the game every single one and i don't know why uh that's your nomura moment it's it's like you get like for this game right it takes so long to get like any spells in order to get guard you have to get past the the second boss of the game which is a reverse armor and it's just like you don't be you can't guard or roll which are your two defensive options so the first part of the game can take for fucking ever uh and you don't get any spells so it's just the attack button and moving and it's just pretty much the same with the rest of the the series where it takes a really long time i think kingdom hearts 3 is the only game that doesn't like make you wait for the main mechanics of the game <laughs> Like, how long does it take to get the drive system in Kingdom Hearts 2? You gotta go through Roxas, which is two hours of your time. Then you oh, gotta get all was, the way... I think for me, that was like four hours, because I yeah, was just it, like, I'm just gonna dick around. Yeah, it takes a long time. Hello, Kyrie. These facial animations have no... Kyrie, don't no, scare no... me like that! Kyrie, so are you Kyrie, Kyrie is inside I mean, me? It's a step up. Oh, I'm really sorry, sorry to bring it back up, Sonic Adventure, but it's still not good. The, the 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 facial animations when they're actually animated are very good for the era. Instead of being fucking just te change swapping a texture. <laughs> yeah, for real. I don't know why they. It, did I that. think it's also just impressive that like a lot of games of the PS2 era don't even bother like lip syncing. It would just be two static models and their their faces would just do like very generic <laughs> flaps. Well, like kind of what kind of what Sora's doing right now. But. It very yeah. depend it was very dependent on the studio because the, the workflow for animation at, at that point, depending on where you go, it was very mm -hmm. much like just get the lip flaps done and then we'll just dub over it. <laughs> yeah. Which is the same like, thing that happens with anime to this day. I wouldn't mind going to see it. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I'd like to see it too. Yeah. It, it, I, I think the animation is probably one of the big things that that made this series really popular because it was like very it was like the most accurate to anime at the time I think. So the bros were great. Look, it's Sora's boyfriend. It's fucking edgy the hedgy over here. Yeah, Sora needs better taste than men. Let me let me tell you. Wait, okay, how so old are these kids again? Right now, I think they're twelve. They have, that uh, kid has more muscle definition than most 20-year-olds, dude. That's because oh, he's... Definition. Okay. I mean, uh, Riku he's, he's carrying, he's carrying like, around lead in those pants. <laughs> this is getting really lead. far ahead, but Riku's kind of stupid and busted. Uh, something's wrong with him. You'll figure it out later. Doc, like, like, bes like besides, besides his unreasonably defined arms. He, he's that, the real that, Sasuke. <laughs> Well, okay, so Kingdom Hearts has this weird thing with triads where there's three friends and one's a girl and one's edgy. Uh, uh, yeah, the, the entire Japanese is Sora. culture has a thing. Yeah, like that's just that you're just you're just describing an anime. <laughs> well, there's like, like four of them in this, in this series. Team Seven, Team Korra, Nine, Team Asuma, <laughs> Team Kakashi. <laughs> like it's either it's either the edgy one team or the Sonic. comic relief. Team Sonic, Team Shadow. Uh, Two logs, team, one cloth, team, one rope. Team Cream. Okay. Hey, hey, I always hey, forget. Bro, playing Kingdom Hearts, I, I could really use one rope. <laughs> Shut up. God damn it. Oh, Lord. So I gotta find some shit for the lady. We're building a raft so we can leave and go and Build explore like the raft. world. So, uh, this, this game, uh, I will say right now, has the best level design of any Kingdom Hearts game. <laughs> The other ones all have like much worse level design. Question, question, question. Yes. Is that bar high? Uh, I mean, I do like the level design in this game. It's very yeah, much- You're not like, answering my question, Anthony. Uh, I, I think the bar for this game is mid. It's somewhere in the middle. So, I, so, so we're starting at mid and we're going, it's only down from here. It, it's only yes. down from here. And it's, okay. because they, it's because they focus their entire like uh, systems and on completely different things. So like this game's combat super uh, limited, uh, but uh, like Kingdom Hearts 2, its combat is amazing. This guy just legit just looks like Sora again. It's Titus from Final Fantasy X. Titus. I killed him. Yep. Here, you beat a poor defenseless child, you <laughs> bastard. He's got the Nyoibo though, I can't do anything about it. Uh, 
Yeah, so we're beating we're just beating the shit out of all these kids. I'm gonna do Waka last because he's an asshole. If we're gonna if we're gonna talk about um if we're gonna talk about Sora and friends wanting to, you know, get out of this town and, you know, explore the world, then we need to figure out what Sora's favorite pop punk band is. Uh whatever sings the intro. Oh god, that's uh the the person who sings the intro to Kingdom to the, the person who sings um, Simple and Clean and the better song, um, Sanctuary, um, is oh, shit, Hikaru... Hot takes. I, oh, fucking <laughs> Sports Take. Um, like, look, I love Simple <laughs> and Clean. Iconic. But I like Sanctuary more. Uh, the Sanctuary answer... Uh, actually, guys, the answer is Bowling for Soup. Oh, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> or this Bowling for Soup. This is canon now. Ow. This guy can eat no, my did, ass, dude. I, 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 I was like, can, can, can this just be the Paraka rap? <laughs> yeah, uh, come on, uh, Um. Waka. I know this looks miss? stupid. <laughs> and that's because it is? Ow. Uh, okay, I'm using an item against Waka. I died. <laughs> Can't beat him. I'm upset, so I'm gonna play him again. I think it actually ate my item. No, it didn't. Yeah, um, Hikaru Utada, non-binary pop singer. Pop singer? I don't know. I don't know what genre know. they operate under, or you classify it as. I classify it, but I think most it's people know them as. Oh yeah, yeah. Most people know them as the Kingdom Hearts music person. Um, and shit, hey. It works, it works. Yeah, I'm not, I, I do I'm feel not a little bad for, like, there's probably these people who, you know, they wanted to be, like, in music, but it's like, they're just known for video games. Like, like... Cross 40. Uh, I, I wanted to say something that wasn't Sonic, but yeah, it's sort of like, like, damn it, uh, you know, we just wanted to be a cool, rock, you know, boomer rock band, and all of our fans are nerds! <laughs> I mean, they do have pretty dedicated fan bases. Yeah, though. it could it could be worse. They could be Nickelback. Nickelback. I, I I feel bad for clowning on Nickelback because I've watched like interviews and the dude is so nice and humble. He's like, no, dude, they're all great. I'm, it's just the, their like, music the sucks. It's not even <laughs> their that their music's music. just the internet culture took their music. It was just like this is garbage now. It's a fact, even though it's not like all that bad. Mostly because me and Anthony sing like, fucking hero every other weekend. My roommate says it all sounds the same. Okay, when I think of Nickelback, I think of Ace Combat 7. Yeah. I think yeah. every time I go back to this. Ace Combat 7, because your fucking wingman in that game, Count, looks almost exactly like Chad Kroger. Yeah. Do, we, do we gotta, do we gotta, do, do, do I need to find the picture again? <laughs> Oh wait! Oh, we oh yeah, that's that right. We had the fight. Send it to send it to Anthony so he can yes. he can put it on the episode. I'll, that put, shit I'll was put funny. it on the episode. All right, uh, Riku, you know, just attack me so I can attack you. Come on. Ah. Come on. Ah. Oh, damn. So Riku's a dickhole. Wait, right, um, I'll put no, it in. No, he's just stupid. Ah. Riku's only just, Riku's not a dick. He's just got one single brain cell, and its name is Kyrie. <laughs> I'd, say, I'd say it was Sora, but Sora's brain cell is also named Kyrie. <laughs> this, it's not wrong. This is a true statement. Oh, I'm gonna die. He, okay, so Riku's an asshole. He has a bajillion health, and he runs around, and he counters you whenever you attack him. And if you get hit, it pretty much almost guarantees you're gonna die. It's almost oh my God. Like it's a game. I, I did it! I, I killed him and he's dead. Fuck you. It's a FromSoft tutorial. Roll credits. Uh, Roll I credits. Beat, Don't I, I you beat walk away. <laughs> okay, let's, let's, let's pretend. Let's do some. Let's do some hypotheticals right now, since we're talking about Kingdom Hearts, and I just mentioned FromSoft and any excuse I can take to okay. um, complain about Armored Core 3's camera controls, I'll take. Okay. Um, Kingdom Hearts. Made by FromSoft. Go. Okay. Make Kingdom Hearts made by FromSoft. A lot okay. more. A lot so more. So what's gonna happen dying. is that it's, this this is gonna stop being a open. Uh, um, what's that word called that they're using for Sonic now? Where it's not open it's not zone? open world open zone game, <laughs> and it's gonna be an open world game now. All happening in the entirety of Disneyland. 
for something else. <laughs> it's no, just in the final, Disney, the final <laughs> boss is Disney's lawyers. Exactly. Uh, the final boss is an, uh, is an, so, is so an you unposing start Disney. Off as, you start off as Sora, but everybody thinks you're a cosplayer. And remember, you can't cosplay at Disneyland. So, so the, the entirety of the cast members are trying to fucking wait, kill you. Wait, is that a <laughs> like, thing? Yeah, I mean, I, it, it, I think it's because, like, the people in the costumes at Disneyland are meant to, like, represent Disneyland. But when you yeah, see yeah. someone in, like, some cheap-ass, uh, you know, Mr. Incredible costume... Well, because, then... like, the, the thing is, like, um, people can confuse you for a cast member. Yeah. And they can start ah. asking you random questions, and if you don't represent Disney properly, it kind of looks bad on them. Can, uh, you, yeah. can you cosplay as other characters? Like, can I go there cosplaying as uh, Riku? I saw... Uh, I don't think so, actually. <laughs> No, I, I knew I actually knew a guy who tried cosplaying Sora at Disneyland, um, and apparently they were like, "Hey man, you you can't cosplay Sora at Disneyland." He was like, "What the fuck?" Yeah, because because <laughs> people are gonna think that Sora is in Disneyland now, and he's not. Oh, uh, it sucks. But that's what I'm saying. So like, so so Sora, they think he's a cosplayer, and so like the entirety of of the Disneyland park is trying to take him down. Like these just regular ass people dressed in like princess outfits, trying to tell him like, "Hey, you gotta get out of here." <laughs> and eventually the comps come and it just turns into GTA because you're basically in like uh, also okay Long Beach. I don't I do not mean to cut you off but no their destinies become intertwined. Riku just tossed. Uh, Riku just tossed this fruit to Sora. This this fruit is the closest thing to an engagement ring in this series. <laughs> and it, yeah. And, and now he's is, running away. And it, they straight up basically say, whenever you give someone this, you're supposed to eat it together, and then your destinies become one. And it's like he's like, here, you want one, don't you? Damn, son, that's kind of no. gay. It is. <laughs> you can't say the G I word. I don't know. Oh, well, also, well we can't have oh, that in a Disney okay, property. Okay, okay. Why doesn't Donald wear this outfit for the rest of the game? I like this outfit. Brand it's the only time he ever uses it. It's a good Brand outfit. recognition. Because Disney's oh. lawyers, remember, from Soft Bosses here, said Donald has to look... Donald can look like this once. <laughs> After that, he Funny must joke. be recognizable. Or it's your <laughs> ass. Stupid ass door. His face is recognizable. And also, are, are you really gonna mistake in that voice? No. Like who else? Who else speaks like that? I want you to Look find me somebody who speaks like this. statues Us outside of statues. Daisy from the originals. Of, uh, the original Daisy. Um, I don't know. But name a name a cheap '80s cartoon villain. You'll probably get an answer. They're all voiced the by uh, Jim Cumming, so no. <laughs> The walrus from from uh, uh, Woody Woodpecker. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you could thank Zeus for that. He introduced me to this character. Hey, come on, do the voice because you do it so well, dude. Like it's, it's, it's dumb. I am how well you do I, it. I hate that stupid hedgehog. It is the, the worst hedgehog. <laughs> Gooby Just like also. This, like, <laughs> when when they told like, when they told the guy to do the voice for the walrus in, in Woody Woodpecker, they were like European. And it's just so like what do you was, mean by that European? It's like all of them. <laughs> so he does all, all of, of Europe. them. He's just yeah. all of he's Europe. A, he's like a German Hollander fucking like Swedish person who randomly speaks with like J's and Y's and mixes and mixes and matches. It's whatever he fancies oh. that day. Also, Donald's eyes are blue, and it's really strange. They've always been blue. Oh, poor Donald. Yeah, no, Those like, I, I thought it was weird, too. But then I looked at a, at a guide for, uh, <laughs> for how to design, how, how the Donald designed it. Yeah, his eyes are always blue. It's yeah. just, um, it's, it's like, if you look in, like, mo almost any colored content, like, up until then, you know, it's Donald's eyes, like, all, all like, duck eyes are just blue. It's always weird. Yep. I, I like mean, a it's just a contrast because it's he has got the white fur. Mm -hmm. Like same thing with like uh, Huey, Dewey, and Louie from the original Ducktales. Yep. Speaking of, I'm surprised. And then they that changed they... it for the new show. It was just kind of like whoa. Uh, it looks a lot better in the new show. I mean, I like a lot of things about the new one. The new one is great. So uh, I'm about I'm about to lose this race. Hold up. Uh. Uh. Oh shit! We get to name the boat. What are we gonna name our ship? Ooh. Ooh. Um. Fuck, I don't know. 
We got name it, name it that. Name it the. <laughs> name, name it the fuck. I don't know. There we go. <laughs> I don't think I have. No, I no. It's not a Sariku. It's uh, Sarik. S O R I K U. S. What was it? S. S O R I K U. <laughs> Sariku. Because that's uh, our yeah. ship. Where's the U? Fuck. Wait, 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 wait. Capital I C R, please. No. <laughs> okay, <there> fine. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit. No, oh, damn it. No, you gotta put the X axis at the end. At the beginning, too. Oh, shit. You're <laughs> X axis, Riku, X axis. Or Riku underscore X axis. There we go. Oh, wait. And, and, uh, and the, the, the O has to be a uh, zero. Oh, fuck you, right? <laughs> Okay, no, no, no. Um, okay, what was everyone's like first exposure to Kingdom Hearts? Because mine is kind of weird. It wasn't the game itself. It, it was, was it, it, it was reaching the memories. No, 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 no. I'm talking like the first time I learned about Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, no, that, that was that was the first right. time I ever learned about Kingdom Hearts. Oh. It's, it's Sor, Sor Riku, S-O-R-I-K-U. There you go. My first time being exposed to Kingdom Hearts it's, 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 one R. was fucking a little big yeah, planet goodness. level that someone made that was just Sorry. themed up in parts. And I was like, oh, this seems kind of neat. And then <laughs> I just okay? had a knowledge of Kingdom Hearts in the back of my head for the next How did he even years. say this? XX or Saruku XX. This is Saruku